What's up guys? So with update 6 we had the introduction of the new Cosmic Quirk Titan which is by far the most broken quirk in the game. It's not even comparable. So with that, keeping that in mind, while well, we also have that 2x drops event active for the weekend, um, I took the time to actually go ahead and farm every single metal cap for the units that I actually need to farm quirks on. Now, this didn't really take uh, a while. Uh, it took me like two hours and I got uh, most of the metal caps. I got one, two, three, four, well, Four and a half, I guess you can say. I didn't really finish Slayer. It was kind of uh, a little bit uh, lazy to continue. And I don't want to waste an entire potion. And I'm not planning to do JJK. I, uh, Georges, sorry. I think uh, Georges is way too time consuming. So essentially, we have uh, a whole bunch of metal caps. And what we're going to attempt to do now is we're going to attempt to get as many Titans as possible with all of these metal caps. Now, Celestial works here as well on my Makima. Um, as you can see in my team as well, I don't know in case you guys uh, noticed or not, I have not gotten a single Titan so far. So yeah, in this video, we're going to see how many Titans we can get with a Metal Cap and what can that do for our team. So obviously, we're going to start with Makima and we can turn on Celestial as well because that's uh, pretty good for now. And if we hit Celestial, we can just swap the Black Hole off. Currently, Titan plus Celestial is the best. So swap your seatbelts, guys. This is going to be a very long re-rolling video so yeah let's see how many titans we can come up with at the end of the video i hope that it's not zero because if it's gonna be zero that's gonna be very depressing but yeah let's jump right into this Okay, so less than 2.5k medals in, we actually get our very first Titan on Makima. Now, so we have the remaining 7.6k medals on Chainsaw, we can actually go ahead and try to hit that uh, Celestial. And if we do hit that Celestial and this 10k down roll, we're basically done with Makima, so that's great. So yeah, let's hope that we hit it. Obviously, Titan Black Hole, it's still not bad. Alright, unfortunately no Celestial, but it doesn't matter, the goal of this video is getting as many Titans as possible. So we're moving on to the next one, Aralgon, so select Black Hole right here, and select Titan, and let's start rolling this one as well. Alright guys, unfortunately Gon doesn't have the same fate. We end up not pulling a Titan on this one, so moving on to the next one. Uh, we're gonna go here on this Kiske Black Hole is selected and hopefully this time we hit. Alright guys, a third roll down, unfortunately nothing yet, so we're 30k in with just one um, of the Titans. Now that's kinda on par, 30k one, technically. Um, we're gonna go for Gojo, obviously Gojo we are gonna hit 100%, so yeah. Um, I'll see you guys when we get the Titan. Okay. 
Okay guys, unfortunately, yet again, not another Titan. Now, I have a couple more medals, but uh, I think since this video has already taken way too long, I've been preparing this video for, I don't know, four hours at this point, including like the farming plaster rolling. I think I'm just gonna farm more and I'm gonna do the same thing yet again. So we're gonna have like 100K in total. But uh, yeah, um, we'll see how that goes. So I'm just gonna roll these and if it doesn't go good, I'm just gonna farm some more tomorrow and we'll try the same thing again and hopefully we'll pull some more Titan. Alright guys, we are back and as you guys can see we are less than 10 minutes before the events actually end. They decided to add a timer this time around for when the event ends. So I guess it's not manually uh, being ended. And as you can see I farmed a whole bunch of metals here. We have 10k chainsaw, 10k um, HXH and like 6k from uh, the bleach metals. So we're gonna try to get some more titans this time around and hopefully for this 26k we we'll get at least one, ideally two, I would say. So yeah, let's see how this goes. Alright, there we go. That is another Titan with 2.16k left. So that's pretty good. Now we're going back to Makima and we're trying to actually get Celestial on this one. And then this unit will also be pretty good. So yeah, two Titans so far. Well, could be better, could be worse, I guess. I don't know. We're like almost at 100k metal store and just two of them. But you know, it always could be worse. Could have gotten nothing. So that's decent. Now, if we do actually hit Celestial on this unit as well, that's gonna be... I'm gonna be pretty okay with that. I'm gonna be satisfied. So yeah, let's see how this goes. Alright guys, after infinite hours of recording, um, <clears throat> finally done, well, done due to the fact of lack of resources, but yeah, pretty underwhelming to be honest, considering that's 100k right there, but yeah, so one Titan with Celestial Algon, 360 million, and uh, Makima with um, Titan plus Black Hole plus Perfection gives 400 million, I think that's the highest like amount of damage that you can get on a Cosmic that's non godly because this has more base damage than um, Celestial. So yeah, um, we still have a long, long, long way to go. 
ideally you want to replace at least these three black holes i want to replace with uh titans this one i'm not really gonna bother um also i'm just gonna keep the double black hole you know just for the sake of having a double black hole unit since it's uh something that's not so achievable anymore i do have uh, these mythics as well like this one but yeah it's not it's not the same so i'm probably just gonna keep this guy as is but yeah anyway this uh video took shit loads of uh time to make and i don't even think that's gonna do that well because it's always like this videos that have a lot of effort don't do well for whatever the reason i don't know but yeah anyway guys um that's pretty much it as always if you have enjoyed make sure to click the like and subscribe button down below and i'll catch you guys all on the next video peace out